welcome to another week. It is extremely hot today. <laughs> I was gonna take you to the beach this morning, but I'm like, no, no, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> so we just walked around outside real quick. It's really hot, there's like no breeze today. And then I walked out her with her for 15 minutes and I got a bug bite on my arm. So I just can't wear t-shirts during the summer, which is not ideal because I can't wear a jacket. It's too bloody hot. Yeah, um, I need to edit my vlog for the day, and I need to finish watching my Korean drama. I'm almost done. I think not. There's still ten episodes, but I can breeze through ten episodes like that. So it's not a big deal. But I'm gonna finish my vlog first before I get too sucked into the drama world again. Um, but yeah, I don't think I have any chores to do. I had to wash a lot of dishes because I didn't do any yesterday. But other than that, today's a nice chill day. It's extremely hot. I just finished watching this movie on your wedding day, and um, it tug at my heartstrings like crazy. Um, it was really funny at the beginning. Really, it's like a romantic comedy, but then it gets really serious and stuff. So yeah, and a tug at my heartstrings. I cried a lot near the middle and end, to the point where I ran out of tissues and I ran out completely, and I had to use toilet paper. <laughs> That's never happened. But I don't have any more boxes on and forgot to buy any, but yeah, I cried that much. I know the kitchen sink still looks like there's still dishes, but I did a big load. It's just that I made dinner right after the dishes, so it's only that that's left. And my dishwasher is full now, of, so I can't dry anymore anyway, so I'll just wash those tomorrow morning when I wake up. Um, it's already a million times better in my kitchen. This is all garbage, so I'm gonna take that down to the garbage later. Not right now, because most likely I'll run into one of my neighbors. And it's fine and all, but it's just awkward because none of them talk, not even smile. And I'm smiling like an idiot. I don't know, <laughs> so I'm just gonna avoid them as in general. Um, and I would say eight or 10 times when I'm down in the garbage room and I encounter somebody, they're probably doing something wrong. So it just irritates me. So whether I irritate myself, I'm just gonna go on a later time. Anyway, so, um, I know what you're thinking, you're thinking, you're thinking I'm going to watch some Korean dramas right now, but I'm going to quickly spray some shoes of some Jason Mark spray. I got some new shoes today, got a good discount on them, and then I also got a package from Amazon. I forgot what I ordered. I'm going to open that, and then I did everything else, so and then I'm just going to relax and play pajamas. But I'm probably going to sleep early today because I'm really tired. I didn't sleep properly again yesterday. The rest of her away. Yeah, let's bring my shoes. So the shoes I got today were these Chuck 70 high tops white. I was contemplating between getting the cream color. I was gonna pass on black because I already have the low top versions in black, so there's no point. I was really leaning towards the cream, but then I tried on the white anyway and they were okay. And I figured, you know what, since I own a lot of dark clothes, white shoes might not be a bad idea. This is my first pair of high tops, so Hopefully I'll look decent in them. I think I look decent in them. And technically that's all that matters, right? And I'm just gonna spray them down. Because they are white, I'm probably gonna spray it twice. Because white shoes get dirty so easily and they turn that yellow dirty color eventually. I don't want that one, but these are the shoes to last because they're really nice. I, prefer, I actually like the gum because it's a little cream color. And I like the blue and red stripes. Anyway, I'm gonna these down. So this is how I watch Korean dramas at night now, basically on my desk table in my bedroom with the lovely warm light. <laughs> and I got my laptop and basically water bottle. That's it. I refuse to eat any snacks, especially at this hour because it's not good for you because you just get fat. And because I'm watching TV or a drama, I know I'm going to snack, so I'm resisting the urge. because I. And the reason why I watch at night is because, you know, that's when I usually have free time, but also the fact that I know I can control my snackage if I watch at night, because I know I'm going to get fat if I do that. I admit, if I watch it during the day, like on my days off, then I'm going to eat some snacks, like chips and what, whatever, but at night I restrict myself to just drink water while watching Korean dramas. I, it's easier said than done, I know it's not easy, because sometimes when someone's watching TV, if they get the munchies, they want to, like, eat something. I don't know, because usually after dinner I'm just like full anyway, so that doesn't really occur to me. <laughs> so, just a bottle of water. Not even a uh, juice or anything, just water. So, yeah, that's the benefit of me watching at night, is that for some reason I can self-control and not eat junk food, but I can't self-control and stop watching. <laughs> so, you know. But yeah, that's what my setup usually. 
This might be a James thing, but I don't know if anyone does this, but for me, after I open a package, before I throw the packaging away, I actually black out my name and address. I don't know why I do it. It might be a work-related thing, because I have to do it work when I'm shipping stuff anyway, so I cross out everything. Plus, I guess, privacy, I guess? But that's me being paranoid, so I don't know if anyone else does it, but I do it. I am starting the vlog very late in the day, mainly because I fell asleep and took a little nap after work. It's okay, because I have the day off tomorrow, so even if I stay up late tonight, it's totally fine. <laughs> um, something exciting, I got a gift yesterday. Someone got me a tablet. <laughs> this is the case. So, it's the new Samsung... Where's the box? Where did I put it? <laughs> Look at the box. I got... My friend got me the Samsung Tab A. Woo! Uh, basically, he saw me researching about it, and then he just got it for me. He's like, which one do you like? I'm like, like, this one. It's a new one. It's a new model for the Tab A. It's the 8.4 inch one. Um, the original model didn't get a good review, but I think we just complained that, you know, the camera wasn't good, but I don't use the tablet for the camera. Your cell phone does a better job, probably, anyway. Why would you be using it? It's so awkward to take a picture of this big thing. Anyway, um, he got me the new model, so I don't have, I can't complain about the camera, but I'm not gonna use it anyway. I have a cell phone that has the same camera. <laughs> It's easier to hold, so yeah. I charged it up, and I bought a case today, so that's why I have a case. But yeah. Um, I'm primarily going to use it for work. I think that's why he got it for me. But also, the reason why I really want a tablet. I haven't had a tablet or an iPad for a few years. Probably like five years when it, my iPad finally broke. The really old iPads. Um, I didn't get one because they're really expensive, and I have a MacBook Pro, so I find it useless. But nowadays... I think they're a good idea, mainly because, where did I, mainly because I can now watch Korean dramas easier. <laughs> Another very hot day today, but compared to yesterday, it's not that bad actually. Um, I have a day off today, well, sort of. Um, I had to go for two meetings today, but it was really simple. I'm home now, I'm about to make some food, but I cleaned some chores, I did some laundry as you saw earlier. I'm gonna wash some dishes first. You just bed, she's eating in the background. I think you can hear her, because I have the AC on right now, so that's me, anyway, I can't hear her. But yeah, um, I do have an issue. This fan that I use during the day when I'm out. Um, it's not working anymore. Like, it's on. It's clearly on. It's rotating. But the fan mechanism's not actually working. There's no air coming out. So everything else, electronically, it's working, but not the fan. And I really like this fan because it has the econ option. So it conserves power so that when I'm out, I can turn it on and you know it's okay. And it's a lot safer, too, during long durations of operation. But now it's hit the crapper and it's not working which is an issue because it's getting hotter, so I need to find a replacement ASAP. But James, you have an air conditioner, I'll just leave it on. I'm not gonna leave the air conditioner on for eight hours when I'm not home. A, it's a lot of wasted power. B, Yuna doesn't really need to be that cool because she is a dog after all, she could regulate heat properly. It's just that the fan I want because it helps a little bit. Plus, it's also very noisy and I don't know if I can turn it on for eight hours when I'm gone for work, so that's why. So um, this one's pretty cheap. I probably can find a replacement really easily, but I don't have time until this weekend, so it's gonna have to wait. But hopefully it's not too hot this weekend. It should be fine. I was able to find some Samjang. It's not the brand I usually buy, but I had no choice because I'm running out. That one has, barely has any left in it. So because I'm eating Samjang, so I'm gonna fry up some pork. Got some rice going right now. Fry the pork, add some green onions, some seasoning to it, and then I've got dinner. Nice and simple. Of course, I'm eating extra rice, so you know we'll have some as well. You guys have probably seen me with this notebook a few times, um, writing in it. Um, basically, this is what I call my to-do list journal. This journal basically consists of to-do lists for every day. Um, a friend of mine, a very close friend of mine, does this quite often, and it gave me an idea that I should start doing it myself. And the importance 
of this to-do list journal is to just keep things simple. I can literally put down something as simple as do laundry, wash dishes, and um, walk Yuna, for example. I just keep it very simple, and the goal is to keep it simple so that how he, well, how my friend said it. Basically, it just feels like you're achieving a lot, and it's a good motivation to keep going. It also keeps track of things you don't forget. And it's true, as I'm ticking things, it's a good feeling that you're getting stuff done. Of course, you can put more difficult things down, but the goal is to, like, complete things to get the sense of motivation going, and it works. It gets me going. It, I constantly check this notebook. Um, if there are things I don't complete that I wrote down on my to-do list, I just put an arrow and I move it to the next day or the day that I know I won't do it. So it, there's no due dates or anything. It's just a checklist. And even if I didn't write in the, on the checklist and I end up doing something that's not on the list, I just write it down afterwards that I did it. So, yeah. If you guys have been wondering what this notebook is, that's what it is. Home from work. Um... Any of you? I am home from work. Um, work was fine. Nothing happened. It was really, really quiet today, surprisingly, for a Saturday. Anyway, um, as usual, I'm not hungry when I get home. I, I think for me, as soon as I get home, I need to, like, relax a bit first before I'm hungry. I think my stomach has to catch up with me. So I'm probably going to play a little bit of video games. I was going to clean, but my house is not messy, so... <laughs> I'm tired anyway, so screw that. I'm gonna play some video games or watch an episode of Korean Drama and then I'll eat something. But yeah, and then I'll take you know for a long walk. I think, yeah. Um, I do have to spray my shoes. I keep forgetting to spray my white shoes. I only spray them twice. Or white shoes, I always spray three times at least. My other shoes, I already spray twice. It's fine. Honestly, I know it's a little bit much for me to spray shoes, but hey, my shoes last longer than normal, so can't complain. Okay, dinner time. I think I'm just gonna make some instant ramen. Yeah, not too complicated. I also picked up a huge tub of kimchi, if you will focus, yeah. <laughs> I don't know, I just like having some kimchi around the house. Is that if I want to add an extra dish to eat with my meal, I have it. I have that choice. I bought it because this one's basically empty. I was, you know, preserving as long as I can, but you know what, I'm like, let's buy a new one. <laughs> so I have some instant noodles. I'm gonna clean out my fridge a little bit because I have some stuff that's kind of old in here I'm gonna throw away. It's not much leftovers or anything. Just really old leftovers. Yeah! I have some salmon, but I'm gonna save that for another day because I don't think it's expiring anytime soon. But yeah, I'm gonna make some instant ramen. I have some sausages to go with it. I could put an egg in too, so perfect. Hi, Yuna. How can I help you? You just keep staring at me. <laughs> okay. Good? Can I stop now? <laughs> okay, um, I just sprayed my new shoes one more time, it's the third time. As I said, yes, it's overkill, but they are white shoes. And my white shoes last longer than normal, because I take good care of my shoes. Because shoes are expensive. <laughs> so yeah, I sprayed this, I'm gonna let it dry overnight. She was drinking water. She always does that to me. Every time I start vlogging, she drinks water. <laughs> it's like an like involuntary action of hers. Anyway. So I did that and I did a little cleaning of the house. That's all clear now. Um, right now I'm probably just gonna go grab a shower and then watch one episode of D-Day. The Korean drama I'm watching right now. Because as much as I think it's a nice drama, I'm gonna like it a bit with this way. As much as I like this drama, there's just too many glaring problems. Not I just hate so many people in that drama. Their characters are such a pain in the ass to watch. And they get angry all the time. So, I don't like that. I mean, getting angry at a drama is not worth it. So that's why I only watch one episode. Because, you know, Kim Young Kwan's in it. And, you know, I gotta watch it. Alright, so I'm gonna go shower. But yeah, it's probably gonna be the end of the day. Hopefully something more exciting happens tomorrow. Look what Kat got me for work. <laughs> She knows it's my favorite drink. Alrighty, so I am home now. Um, Jason actually came over for like an hour or so because we were working on a little project together. Um, I can't share it just yet, top secret, but if you know me, you probably know what it is already. If not, you'll eventually find out anyway, not a big deal. Um, and then I just drove Jason home, took Yuna for a long walk. She's fast asleep right now. 
Um, I was gonna clean dishes for a bit, but I'm actually quite tired. I don't want tired, but I'm just too lazy. So what I'm probably gonna do is just take it easy, watch Korean drama, and go to bed. It's actually, surprisingly, I'm not gonna play any video games. I just wanna finish that Korean drama. Okay, let's get this over with. I have, what, two episodes left? I can't wait to finish this and move on. You're probably wondering why I'm bothered watching this, if this pisses me off so much. Is that, you know, everyone in the drama sucks except for Kim young Gwan. It's not because I'm being biased. He's literally the only reason why this drama is actually bearable to watch. Like, I just hate everyone in the drama. <laughs> like, in the whole hospital during this disaster, only four doctors are useful. The others are just, why are you doctors? <laughs> like, they would, like, oh, I don't want to do the surgery. Or, um, I don't know what to do. Or they'll start the surgery and halfway go, I don't know what to do, and leave. Literally leave in the middle of operation. What kind of doctor does that? And why did you even be a doctor? How did you even graduate? There's a lot of that. That's why I hate this drama so much. Because every episode is somewhat similar. The hospital director bitches and complains. And threatens to close the hospital down because he's only wholly held accountable. The best, so-called best doctor in the hospital always doubts uh, Kim Young guans capability. And if that's a good idea for him to do certain things. And then there's these other four doctors that are just there complaining about why they're working so hard. I'm like, it's a freaking earthquake. And then they abandon their shift sometimes, or um, they don't know what to do for the patient. And I'm like wondering, why are they doctors? <laughs> and then then the reason why the love, the chemistry with uh, the main characters, it's okay. It's just that I don't like her very much because she looks like she's always confused and looks like her face wants to take a poo. <laughs> That's, I'm not being mean, is what I see. Alright, I'm just get through this. I'm almost done. But yeah, for that, I'm probably gonna end the week here. So, as always, guys, I'll see y'all next week.